Hi, I'm Carolyn Evans, one of the client technical trainers here at Granite Telecommunications. This is the video series on the Max UC desktop application. This tutorial is going to help you understand and use the most common features of the Max UC desktop application. In this next video, we're going to be covering how to use the Max UC desktop application. In this video, we will describe the icons and menu options within the Max UC desktop client interface. Let's start with the top menu options. From the file menu, you can do the following. Change password. Click this option to view a pop-up where your password can be changed. Enter your old password for Max UC Desktop Client and the new password in the provided boxes. Enter your new password again in the Verify Input box and click Change Password. You can mute sound notifications, add contacts, new group chat, sign out of chat, log out, quit. Quit will close out the application. From the tools menu, you can choose from options. This enables you to make changes to the way your soft phone behaves and to test your audio and video equipment. Conference manager, apps, view a range of apps you can download. View account allows you to access and change your password and voicemail pin. The help menu allows you to access the max help menu and gives you the ability to send feedback and check for updates. Next, let's focus on the main menu panel. The main panel includes your photo. This is used as your avatar for instant messaging. If you don't have an instant messaging account, this image will not appear. Also included is your name and possibly your phone number. The main panel also houses the dial pad or keypad that is used to make calls. To use the dial pad, click on the dial pad icon. This will expand a window to show an actual dial pad. Use it to enter a valid 10-digit number or extension. When complete, click on the call button. If you choose to not use the dial pad, you can also enter the number manually within the name and number dialog box. It also houses a voicemail indicator. This is located to the right of the enter name or number field. If you have a voicemail waiting for you, you will see it here. The number shows the amount of messages you have received. Lastly, the main panel houses your presence information. The following icons will determine what presence your account is set to. Orange indicates that you are either on a phone or busy. Yellow indicates that you've been inactive for a length of time. Green indicates that you're currently online and available for calls. Red indicates that you are set to do not disturb. You are able to change your presence at any time. At a glance, you will see how many missed calls and messages you may have. Click the Recent tab to view your calls and chats. Missed, received, and dialed calls are differentiated by the following icons. Blue for calls placed, green for calls received and answered, red for calls that were received but unanswered. The interface has the main tabs that most of your information is stored within. The Contacts tab displays a list of your contacts in alphabetical order. From within the Contacts tab, you can right-click on a contact and add them to your favorites list by selecting Add to Favorites from the menu. Use the Favorites tab to view your most commonly used contacts. Favorite contacts appear with a yellow star badge beside their name. The Recents tab not only lists the most recent dialed, received, and missed calls, but also provides you a list of instant messages. Thank you for watching this video on the Max UC desktop application. If you have any questions or concerns, please feel free to reach out to client training at granitenet.com. We'll be more than happy to assist. If you like what you see here, please feel free to like, comment, and subscribe to our YouTube channel.